Hi, I'm Sarah. I live in New York City and I have crabs. The reason I'm making these videos is to actually show you how to take care of your hermit crabs, or hermes as some of us call them, as a lot of times the pet stores don't tend to give people the right information. But enough about that. Let's get your tank set up right. Okay, so one of the first things that hermit crabs need is actually really high humidity in the tank. A fun hermit crab fact is hermit crabs actually have gills. So even though these little guys are land hermit crabs and don't live in the ocean, they actually have a type of gill similar to other marine creatures. Hermit crabs do start out in the ocean. When they mate, they release their eggs into the sea. Those eggs become little baby hermit crabs. They get a little bigger, they find a snail shell to move into, and then they crawl up onto the beach where they'll spend the rest of their crabby little lives. They keep their gills, which is why they need moisture in the air to breathe. And when they don't get this, they're actually slowly suffocating. So how can you make your tank look more like the beach? I'd say one of the most important things is making it as airtight as possible. You may have noticed my very poor decorating job. I'm clearly going for function over form, but this is how I keep the moisture in the tank. Some people actually get a fitted piece of plexiglass and put it on top of the tank. I am lazy and I am cheap. So I went to the grocery store and got saran wrap. It does the trick. You can make your tank warm with a heating pad. I have one stuck on the side and plugged into the back. And then you can also give them a little spritz. And once you have a way to keep the moisture in, you'll notice that your humidity levels will go up. So the next question is, how do you know if you have high enough heat and humidity? So I actually have an accurate thermometer in there. No, I'm not getting sponsored to say that, unfortunately. They can if they want to. But it measures both the temperature and the humidity, and you want to aim for about 80% for each. So this is what most hermit crabs are sold in. As you can see, there's no way to keep moisture in the air in this little tiny plastic box. I don't recommend buying hermit crabs. All mine have actually been adopted and given to me from people who can't take care of them anymore. But if you do have crabs, I'm here to show you how to help them live long, happy, little crab lives. Keep watching and subscribe. And remember, always stay crabby.